So your birthday's in two days. How, do, how does it feel? You're not going to be 21 anymore. Feels like I'm 21 years, 363 days old. 7,675 minutes? No. 529,000. You're saying your birthday's not on Sunday? Minutes. It's not the 12th? What do you mean? Your birthday's not November 12th? 12 12? Is it not that? Am I stupid? I don't get it. I'm being dead ass. I'm not. <laughs> it this is isn't the a, 21st. Or is the, what? It is the 12th. Is that not Sunday? Yeah. I thought you were playing a lot. I, I thought I was freaking out. No. That's why I said I feel like I'm 21 years and 363 days old. <laughs> what? Isn't 365 days? That'd be a 25. So wouldn't minus you say two. 60, 64 days and then the minutes? I didn't say the minutes. So you said three, 363 days. Exactly. Why would it be that? Because it's Friday. So Saturday would be 364. No. I'm talking about... What are we talking about? I don't know, Chief. I'm going to kill myself. <laughs> Drink more water. <laughs> Drink more water, I guess. <laughs> What's up, guys? What the fuck was that intro? Hey, man. We're trying our best. Okay? We're trying our best. Our best may only rake in under 20 views, but you know what? That's our best. All but right? it gets us 64 subscribers. Hey, dog. <laughs> yeah, it does. That's what I mean. What's up, guys? We made it episode 14, our longest streak yet. All right, let's. <laughs> I like that I say it's our longest streak yet every start of every episode. <laughs> I mean, it's true because every episode but is the start it. of a new streak. Think about it. One of these days, you're not going to say that. What are you trying to say? You think we're going to break our streak? Sometime. No. It's not going to happen because even when we know that we're going to miss a recording week, we're going to record a week in advance. You mean two days in advance? No. You mean 765,365? Anyways, my birthday is on Sunday. (laughs) Crazy. And and are you excited? Uh, Yes. I've always been a big birthday goer. And you got to you got to finally post your Taylor Swift song. I don't 20. know about you, but I'm feeling 22. You know? I know. That's crazy. I'm turning 22. I know. I was talking to our coworkers about that because they were like, <laughs> oh, my gosh, your birthday is on Sunday. Like You're, you're going to be, what, 22? And I was like, yeah. And I was like, isn't it crazy that you've known me since I was 16? And they were like, yeah. <laughs> and I was like, dang. What's the point of this story right now? Couldn't tell you. What are you doing for your birthday on Sunday? Uh, I don't really have anything crazy planned. Avery wants to try to plan it something. Like we go out to dinner with my family and stuff. Maybe I'll go out to brunch with like all my besties. And who who might that be? That'd be you. Oh, okay. Well, I'm and uh, two other individuals that don't deserve the recognition on this podcast um well let me tell you up front i do go and work at 12 on sunday word it would be at like nine or something so i'm gonna tell you this right now (laughs) (laughs) i'm just kidding i'm going to play (laughs) yeah that's what i was gonna (laughs) say um so if you wanted to go play basketball with me i don't know yeah, I don't know. besides that, I don't have any plans. I was told I have to go into work to see everyone. We'll see <laughs> if I actually shots. do that or not. I don't know. I'm, I've like always been a big birthday person, but I've never like been one to celebrate it, you know? Yeah. Does that make sense at all? I like celebrating it. I don't like planning the celebrations. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, good. I've always been like, I won't throw a party for myself, but if someone else throws it for me, I'm all down, you know? Yeah, and I just... 
I'm not I'm not a big holiday person in general. Like I just don't like celebrating. I'm just a very sad individual. That's what I've come to realize. You're not sad. What is that supposed to mean? Why are you lying? Your depression to me? is fake. It's You're not, not sad. It's not even depression. It's just like I don't have the effort to try. <laughs> you know what? That's fair. That's totally fair. Honestly. Because guess what? What? It's just gonna happen next year. Ugh. I don't want to hear that. Not, Shh. not, not. Birth, birthdays Shh. are different. Oh, okay. Birthdays are different because it doesn't matter if it's because, a holiday that happens because next people year. die. I'm sorry to be morbid, but people die. Okay, people die, and you won't be able to celebrate next Christmas with them either. Jesus. <laughs> what? <laughs> the Easter Bunny? What? <laughs> Did you just compare the Easter Bunny to Jesus? Is that not what it is? It's life. Jesus, it's the rebirth of Christ. Okay, but the you Easter, said that yeah, the Easter you said, Bunny is it's Happy Zombie Jesus Day. You said Christmas, uh huh, and they're not going to celebrate Christmas the next year. I'm talking about birthdays. I said all all about birthdays. I'm too tired for this. I don't understand what's happening right now. It's okay. It's been a long and stressful week. <laughs> it's Monday. <laughs> <laughs> well uh, it's dog, my saturday dog, so dog. <laughs> that's crazy and your week the rest of your week is going to be actually really great because it is what be happens great. on thursday i'm a i have a very busy individual i'm gonna have a good stuff to talk about next episode yeah. so tune in next week leave this one i don't care just kidding i do care stay around but yeah, I have a busy schedule. I got an orchestra to go to. I have an anniversary to go to. I got you sound like a millionaire. A birthday right now. to go to. <laughs> I mean, I'm wearing the fit for it. Why not, right? Yeah. All you're missing is uh, being from Eugene. <laughs> true, very true. Where is Eugene? Oregon. Where's Oregon? Upper left. <laughs> Of the U.S. Where's the U.S.? North America. Oh, okay. That's right above South America, right? Exactly. Okay. Just north of it, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay. You're welcome. I was like, at my internship today, the guys were like talking to me and they were like, so you're going to grow out your beard for No Shave November? And I was like, no. But you're doing it. <laughs> no. Oh, okay. It's just not my shaving day. My shaving day is Wednesdays. This is the longest anyone has seen it in the pod in a while. <laughs> I was going to say something, but chose not to. We're going to be like, our no. co-workers see it all the time. No. You're right, not, our co-workers don't watch this. That's not what I was going to say. What were you going to say? I was going to say, because you said long. Mm-hmm. And it's the longest that they've ever seen it on the podcast. And I was going to say, <laughs> yeah, now you know. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to say it. I'm going to leave uh-huh. it out up for interpretation for our audio listeners. Because if you're listening on our audio, goddamn, I love you so much. You're amazing. Me, on the other hand, I won't leave it up for interpretation. He was referring to my fat, long cock. And like I said earlier, he only has one of those things. You didn't say that in the episode, and now these people are confused. Good job for, for confusing them. How do you feel? Hmm? Yeah, take a break. You and your stupid ass hat. Think about what you've done. Think about what the shame you've brought this podcast with just your hat. Huh? You ever think about that? You should. Yeah. Joke's on you. I called the police. They're outside right now. Do you hear them? No. I don't either anymore. Mm. There was a siren. You fucker. Mm. I called them. Maybe you called them off. Why do you hate me so much, huh? You ever just have an internal rage when you look at someone? No. Yeah. 
I'm pretty just high all the time and just glad to be alive, you know? Glad to be walking on the planet Earth. But not glad enough to celebrate a holiday? No. Sorry. That's how I was raised. Anyways, <laughs> back to what were you even talking about? Oh, yeah, my internship. Man, what is this episode already? <laughs> what has happened? I don't know. I thought it started off pretty good. I guess we gotta just end it here. The Drink More Water channel's done. Finito. Yeah. Finito Bebito. Unfortunately. It was a pleasure working with you. My hand's kind of clammy from holding this thing. So This now concludes our longest streak ever. <laughs> this does conclude our longest streak ever. 11 minutes. Made it 11 minutes. It's our longest streak yet. Do you think people would watch this if we were like, we're breaking up and then it was only 11 minutes? No. Yeah, you're right. Because I don't watch any of our shit. <laughs> we post. Watch anything. Hopefully that'll change. We We make it for us. That's fair. Hopefully that'll change when we start making TikToks. Who, well, who is going to be making TikToks? Did you see the TikTok I posted? I did see the TikTok because you sent it to me. Yeah, because it and I liked it. In a span, so you should have gotten it. In a span of probably five hours, it got zero views. <laughs> That's why I sent it to you. <laughs> I was like, "What the actual fuck, dog? How do we post this TikTok and it gets zero views? I didn't know that was possible." No. Yeah. Well, I don't know. Like, I'm just... You know how I just said that I was really happy? I'm just... I want to move somewhere. Like, I had that... I had, I've had this thought for a while. Mm -hmm. But, like, moving somewhere? That'd be nice. Moving Fresh where? start? Oh. Somewhere new. Yeah. You want to come along? Let's go. Sometimes I, I think about that. I booked a flight to Columbia. Oh. Nice. That's why I'm getting my passport. Oh, okay, cool. Told you. Yeah. We're going back to the homeland. <laughs> That's my homeland. Is that not what... Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> you can't say that online, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't finish the joke. But I will. No. Whoa. <laughs> can't do that on this channel any either what is going on with this episode are you i don't know <laughs> do you want to restart no we're already 13 minutes in and if this is how we are now then we can't <laughs> this is what we're gonna do i don't even know where it is is my water bottle my backpack behind you sick this is what we're gonna do we're gonna stop everyone watching everyone listening we're going to stop. Everyone go grab us some water. We'll we'll stall while you're going to grab some water, okay? My I favorite don't know Pokemon about you, is but I'm Charmander. Because Charmander is the first evolution. No one cares about Pokemon. Okay, we're back. We have our water. Everyone's opening it up. Everyone's getting it ready. We're going to shake it off. Go ahead. I'm a I'm the Taylor Swift hater. Hey. Thank you. Everyone at home. Okay. Now we all take a drink of water. And then we all exhale together. <laughs> and we're back we're all we're all better you know what do you prefer room temperature water yes or cold water i like like slightly colder than room temperature water because like cold water i can't just chug it you know like i could only drink so much before it gets too cold just say that you're soft stop i'm pretty soft i won't lie to you can't make you hard, so respectfully, but you no can one can make water hard. 
No, that's ice. We were supposed to be better after drinking the water. <laughs> I came up with a whole different topic, and you're just going straight back to the negatives. What do you mean the Look negatives? Look at you pointing your out the negatives. Your topic is you said bad anyway. joke. This was your joke. Make water hard. Okay, so That's what else ice. do you want to do? Let's How about you tell me about your weekend? How about you tell me about basketball? I said like, you wouldn't tell me about it yesterday. Nothing happened. Someone, someone dislocated their pinky. This is me at work yesterday. I'm like, how was the basketball going? He was like, guess you have to find out on this week's episode. Okay, I'm waiting to find out about this Bro, week's why, episode. Bro, why am I always the fucking victim in this situation? You're always pointing the finger at me. Because. I'm never pointing the finger at you. Like, I'm always just taking and taking and taking. I'm feeling like these OnlyFans models that we just fucking posted a video about. I'm trying, trying to make a good podcast episode. And you're just sitting there and being like, you, 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 you. You said this. You said this. Tell them about your weekend. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I did. I worked my whole weekend. I played basketball. It's the same shit. Different fucking day. Oh, man. You know what? If that's your mindset, then what are we doing this podcast for? I've been asking myself that question for the last 13 years. We talked well, about this I, with our grandchildren. I can tell. God damn it. I can tell. You haven't visited your grandchild in a week. I could tell. All those gray hairs. Jesus Christ. Piece of shit. We still have 40 minutes. 40 minutes. And how many times are you going to accuse me in those 40 minutes? A lot. Good. Maybe if you did better. I wouldn't have to accuse you. You ever think about that? Every day. <laughs> Listen. I got nothing to say. So, did you see the new Ice Spice thing? How no. she's going to collaborate with stuff? With stuff? Yeah. What stuff? Doc McStuffins. The Disney Channel show. Did you hear? No. No. Doc McStuffins. Because I made it up. Disney I don't know channel? what else to talk about. Doc McStuffins is collabing with Ice Spice. Yeah. They're going to make a TV show dedicated to all the delinquents out there. Did you just call Ice Spice a delinquent? Yeah, I did. Only gingers are delinquents. Did you, you heard just it? use the hard R on. I did. And I'm not scared about it. Wow. Just wait until I take make this video a pod TikTok and take that out of context. Do it. What are you going to do with those M&Ms? You're holding them very tightly. <laughs> I'm hoping that if I eat a lot of them, I'll have a sugar high and just do something. Well, they are not open yet. I so. know. <laughs> That's what's holding me back. Thanks. That and the fact that I've had a lot of sugar today already. Oh, what'd you eat today? What? <laughs> this is one of our channels. <laughs> Let's see. I I had a single donut with a Cliff Bar for breakfast. This sounds delicious. Then I had a Subway sandwich. With a cherry Coke and Lay's chips. And then I had a homemade stir fry with a Dr. Pepper. I can't I can't get Jared Fogle out of my head after you said Subway. God damn it. <laughs> how did Jared's Jared taste, huh? You just asked me how Jared tasted. Yes, how did Jared taste? Because you had him today. Does it taste like prison bars? <laughs> yeah whatever happened to that guy he's in prison <laughs> Ryan why he seemed like such a genuine guy he took the sub way too often <laughs> he took the foot long way too serious five dollars is it on record for how big his dick is at least a meter a, me a meter <laughs> Yeah. Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's 
like over three feet, dog. He had a lot of friends. So, because you know, that many feet equals a meter. <laughs> what? <laughs> a foot long. I don't fucking know. <laughs> I'm trying to come up with something. <laughs> I'm literally trying. So I'm putting my whole fucking pussy in it. And nothing. Yeah, your pussy's pretty dry. It's just fucking, it's bouncing off. I'm <laughs> echoing into the distance. I'm going, hello. Listen, I'm all for it. I really appreciate hello. it. Hello. But... <laughs> What did you? How, where did the friends come from with the whole foot long thing? Because I said a meter, and you said one. you said you said a meter. That's that's pretty long. And I said, yeah, he needed a bunch of friends. That's why he had a foot long. So a meter, a bunch of friends. That's why he got the sandwich. They had to cut it up into foot feet, so they could all take it. All of his friends. I'm fucking trying. <laughs> I'm trying to explain my stupid joke. No, yeah, to I appreciate you're it. You're just you sitting. Did. There. <laughs> You are just sitting there looking at me, deadpan. You are looking at me like. <laughs> what else do you want me to do? I, listen, I was looking at you like that because I didn't understand the joke still. And I was in the middle of explaining it I know, and you still even, were just like. Do you, even during your explanation, I didn't understand that. No. But then it all connected. <laughs> so you were saying he ordered a meter long foot long. The size of his dick. Did I just say a meter long foot long? Oh, yes. Yes, you did. But I understand. A meter long sandwich because he has a bunch of friends and they all needed to cut it up to share. Uh-huh. That's exactly what I said. But we were talking about his dick. And that is why I said his dick is a meter. So you're saying his dick family size is big dick. enough to share with family friends. Family size dick. That's what I'm talking about. That's why I went to jail. That's why he's behind bars. <laughs> he <laughs> they just turned 18. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Did you ever go to prison? No. <laughs> no, not even for the experience. I mean, I've heard the bad things about the Dementors, but... <laughs> <laughs> oh brother this guy's this is the podcast you can't add that i in. know <laughs> that's why i gotta use it with my own vocal effects this is what we're resorting to the stuff that we use in our normal videos we're just adding in and throwing <laughs> into the podcast i want else i want everyone to know this is what a no this isn't even what a normal conversation between us is like no it's not it kind Actually, of is it's more in depth yeah it's usually <laughs> and not like this yeah this is like Saturday night, just worked 12 hours. We're tired. End of the shift. We're tired. People coming in. That's the type of conversations we're having right now. No, because I feel like we're more coherent when we're like that. <laughs> That's fair. Because we're like, we have one thing on our mind. Going the fuck home. Yeah, we're all just, sh we're just, shut the fuck. Corey will say something. Just, shut up, bro. Yeah, I don't it's care. just like that every single day. I just live like that, you know? <laughs> Stop it. It's, don't it's, paint me as it's, the bad guy. It's, I'm not painting you as the bad guy. I'm just saying it's nice to be loved every once in a while. I you know? love you all the time. I told you not to kill yourself the other day. If that's oh. not love, then I don't know what else is. You know who I listen to? Suicide Boys. I just was listening to the TMG Classic, and he mentioned Scrim from Suicide Boys. And once again, I felt like my worlds were colliding. Because first, it was the basement yard and TMG talking about each other. I'm pretty sure Cody Ko went on the basement yard, actually. And then now... TMG was talking about Suicide Boys. I was like, they just hit everything. Everything in my life. Just See, this merged. is what gets the fucking clicks. Where was this five minutes ago? Come on. Yes. Yes. This is what gets the clicks. Oh, my God. I'm so excited. So you're telling me they didn't talk about Ruby at all? No. The most important scrim. one in Suicide Boys. It was like, they talked about Scrim. Oh, you say Scrim was the most, or the Ruby was the most important? Yes. Yeah, that's facts. Exactly. Ruby the motherfucker. <sighs> Moving but that's around. sick. Yeah, they were talking about his height because they were flaming. Because he's short as fuck. They were flaming Russ for being tall. No, or, short. Oh yeah, because Russ is short. First mm. of all, before I get into this, what was the beef with Russ and TMG, <laughs> or just Russ in general back in like? They did, well, didn't Russ just make music for fuckboys? I don't know. 
just i'm pretty sure the first classic they released and now this one they released just flame and rust the well, whole they also made a whole thing about uh it was with them and spock and it was reading like stuff like oh, cringy that. stuff with yeah. rust and that was stuff. one of their that's cringes things yeah 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 what the heck did rust do i didn't realize he was so hated during this time i mean <laughs> no comment but continue all right. Anyways, they were talking about how they were flaming Russ for being short or whatever. Yeah. And then they were like, who's a tall rapper? And then Noel was like, I think Scrim from like Suicide Boys is pretty tall. And that was it. That was the only reference he made. But I was like, why didn't he say Young Gravy? I don't know if Young Gravy was prevalent in that time. When was that released? Uh, it was like their first season. So like five or six years ago. All right, but he wasn't like that big. Mr. Clean was very popular. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. And that was about eight years ago. Listen, no one cares about fucking whatever his name is. Something gravy. Young gravy. So you know his last name, (laughs) but you don't have the effort to remember his first name. I'm a man of honor and respect of i only course. refer to people as their last names and you respect their time i understand exactly true <sighs> that man is tall did we talk about how he got kicked yeah we did how he got yeah, kicked out did. of the concert did you see the basketball bounce across the screen it's pretty cool also we're losing what is that i have the nuggets score right here just because we ran out of things to talk about i was like oh maybe then we got the nuggets you know yeah Speaking about the night, I just got a new jersey today. You did. Surprised you didn't bring it with you. Uh, yeah, I don't want to be like some people. True Nuggets fans. I want to wear it on special occasions. That's fair. I really want that jersey. He got the newest City Edition jersey, and, and I want that one. Did I I know I literally saw it, but I can't remember who you got. Was it Jokic? Gordon? Okay. That's who I would want for it. Yeah. Either Gordon or Porter. Mm-hmm. They had, I was I was looking for it, and they were like, oh, we don't have an XL in the, the Gordon jersey. And I'm like, fuck. Like, no. But then they're like, oh, wait. And I was like, <gasps> but then the, I got the last one. Nugget gods themselves blessed you. Yeah, I want to get the, I want to get the shirt, too. I haven't seen the shirt. Is it just the exact same design? The exact or? same. Yeah. Word. Word. And I was thinking about getting the hat, too, but. I just decided on the jersey because that's fair. That was, I don't have a jersey yet. Yeah, good decision. I'm tired of still yours. <laughs> fair. Yeah. Now yeah. I actually have one for myself. Yeah, I'm a true Nugget, Nuggets fan now. Yeah, you are. I'm proud of you. It feels good. I'm proud of you. Thanks. Yeah, I try really hard. Let me tell you, I'm not a Nuggets fan tonight, though. <laughs> Why? Because they're losing by twelve. <laughs> Maybe, man. <laughs> It's not looking too hot. I think we might just have to stop recording when they play. Because the last time they lost, we also were recording. The only time they've lost is when we record. So, I don't know if that's a sign or not. All right, so that's it for today's episode. <laughs> 30 minutes in, we got to cut it. We got to leave. Got to spl- gotta skedaddle. Got to skadoodle. Skadoodle or noodle. Mr. French Labrador Poodle. Bars. The rest of this episode, we're actually going to wrap. So uh, here's Corey's first freestyle. And go. I'm all in her guts just like the Twin Towers. I'm not flicking her butt. I'm talking Austin Powers. I like it when it rains, not when it showers. I've been waiting in the car with the windows rolled up for about seven hours. <clears throat> That's pretty good. Thank you. Yeah. Straight off the dome. Nice. Thank you. you You're stalling, stalling, right? Uh, stalling? Yeah, like Joseph. Stalin. Gotcha. Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> Naming our favorite dictators or what? You could say that. You have one of those, right? No. Who was yours? You were saying it before the podcast. Oh, yeah. Um, Hero Brian. 
Hero Brian? Yeah. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I was like, who is that? <laughs> <laughs> That's good. The I have not only it was a deep cut, him, right? <laughs> yeah. Nice. Nice. He's actually on the cover. Did you see that? No. When was he on the cover? He's like in the background. No way. Yeah. That's fake. Let's look it up right now. Yeah, let's look it up. We got nothing better to do. <laughs> Minecraft. I hope you turned off your mic before. <laughs> okay. Minecraft. Hero Brian. Hero. Brian. Uh, Cover. All right. So we got the generic one. Is this the one you're referring to? I think it's that one. This one? No. This one? Yeah. All right. Like, he's in the... Like, they, like, zoomed in, and he, he was, like, in the back in the trees. Interesting. So, I don't know, man. I don't know. I could be I fucking don't know, capping. chief. Could be I capping. No. Did I you ever see Hair Brian? Didn't know. Yeah, me either. I thought it was, like, the... Like, the clitoris. It's, like, a myth. It's not real. What's a clitoris? Exactly. Do you see him? Because oh. I sure don't. Oh, there he is. The blue and the eye. Boop. Wow. Diary of a Minecraft Hero Brian. Box S- set. Volume 1. You think we could... An unofficial Minecraft You think we could get that and then resell it for profit? Probably. How much? I'm very intrigued about you this. think I can get a golden iron for it? It's an audio book. It's free. Oh. We can obviously sell it for money. It's free. Perfect. We can make a profit on it. I want to get a sample of this. Day one. The battle between players and zombies. Bright light. A sharp pain. Whoa. Is this a... (laughs) Whoa. And then I opened my eyes to find myself in the middle of a real battlefield. All around me, there are creatures fighting and trying to kill each other. I am too young, and right now, very disoriented and lonely. I don't know. How to sounds finish. like every Disney opening Disney movie. <laughs> she said, "Loud noises." It was hard. Bright lights. I'm in my bed. Flashing. Arms tied. Lights. <laughs> There's someone in the room with me. It's my dad. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> he has come to behead me. Oh, I mean, that's better than what I was going to say. As he takes a pull from the lawnmower. Rum, num, 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 num. Rum, num, 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 num. My heart beats. What are you going to do with the week that I'm not at work? Go into cardiac arrest. That's fair. That's it? I'm not going to be happy. Are you ever happy at work? Yeah. Not this last day. On Thursdays, Saturdays, and Sundays at 4. Not this past Sunday at 4. No. (laughs) I haven't been really liking any Sundays lately. I feel like picking up that extra shift is really taking a toll on my mental health. Two doubles back to back. It's rough. It's a little rough, but yeah. you know what? Mama didn't raise no bitch. She did raise a boss, though. Not the boss yet. You'll get there. <laughs> no, I won't. She will. No, when I we open won't. up our own store. With, with all the shit that I've been... I've been getting handed piles or plates of shit. Uh-huh. You know? At work? Yeah. From who? I would say names, but they could be watching. <laughs> Are they in the room with us right now? <laughs> what the? <laughs> I was talking to my dad about that today because I was like going to the. So. I 
the store we work out had a gr- br- what the oh my god so the store that we work at the store we he was work talking at, with his dad earlier today about no something so the store we work at opened a brand new location colorado springs and they had me go over and help the grand opening multiple other people went as well but me in the kitchen helped take care of the grunt of it yeah because he's built different period so they took me over there. I was like working. They they have a really nice kitchen. I know. I heard. They yeah. have a really nice place in general. Yeah, it is really nice. Fucking Everything. massive. But working there, I was like, bro, Corey and I could do this so easily. Yeah. The only thing we would struggle with, obviously, money. Trying to find find the funds to actually open up a store. Yeah. But then I was like, we can make it work, dog. How? I don't know. Find fucking... We'd like ask banks and then I'm sure our man Carlos would help us out. He'd be like, yeah, they suck. <laughs> no, he would be like, ah, maybe he would help like pay for some of it and then we pay him back, you know? Instead yeah. of taking out loans or whatever. Yeah. Anyways. But then I was like, bro, we could easily do this. Like like we've talked about before. I take care about the back of the house. You take care of the front. Mm-hmm cake wings <laughs> god damn it <laughs> right when i <laughs> i got to stop you in your track sometimes right when i'm on <laughs> <laughs> on a roll right when i'm on track to get right, this thing rolling <laughs> right stop when, me right when i'm about to call you butter <laughs> Stop it with all this. All this what? <laughs> Blasphemy. Blasphemy. So all I'm saying is let's open one. Like Northish, Arvada, Westminster, Fort Collins. Out of state. That work possibly too. I feel like I mean out of state could work. Just feel like in state it would be more like we know we know the areas. But then we can know the sauces and how they're made, and we don't need search. I don't know if they would let us. You think they would ship the sauces to us? Good question. I want, I've been wondering. To, I've been wanting to ask him how he's going to be doing that for the Kentucky store. They're probably going to know the recipe. There's no way he's going to trust a random person who's buying into the franchise. Well, when you're out of state, how else are you supposed to get it there? You think he's going to ship a fucking two million gallon drum? Of golden flame no. sauce? They could make it monthly. Sergio will make it monthly. And then that's part of the other the Kentucky stores. That's part of their expenses. They Because they already have to pay for the sauces. So maybe they just have to pay for the shipping now. You know it would be a, a, a lot easier? It may be they easier. Give them, give them a little sheet of paper with all the recipes on it. Say, here, go get these. If you tell me one... We'll behead you and your your dog. That's okay. That'd be like saying Pepsi is like, oh, we're an American based company, but we're trying to sell stuff in the and they still UK. do coke in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> but we're trying to sell stuff in the UK. So here's our secret recipe. Why would they just give that out? Because they're the same company. Yeah, but you can't. I don't know, dog. I don't well, know, dog. I don't know, Chief. What do you... I'm just... I'm I'm baffled by the idea that you think Serge and Carlos are going to make more sauce. Well, they can make more sauce. It doesn't matter. But they're going to do that. Ship it every month. And they're going to ship down a month's supply which is how much sauce? How much sauce do we go through a week? How much? Because well, we go through at least one of those buckets, one every two days. I'll say that. Yeah, but we're a busy store. We can't assume that they'll be busy. Why not? They're in a different state. Doesn't mean that they'll be busy. They don't have a golden flame. Doesn't mean that they'll be busy. People want wings. They're, wing stop, Buffalo Wild Wings. Who cares? Oh, new wings. 
Golden. What is this? Golden Flame. I'm sure there's a wing. This is not, there too. It's though. it's run by Drink More Water. <laughs> what is this? Corey, Corey and Brian. Who is this? They're gonna come flying into the stores. Tell me not. I still think you would ship it easily. Ye- All right. Yeah, we'll go with we'll go with what you say. I guess we'll just have to ask our man Carlos or Serge. That works too, because you know, once you want to know the the sauce, you got to talk to the <laughs> sauce maker, the sauce man himself. Do you think if they get big enough, Sergio will just like start making sauces full time and not have to work in the kitchen? Can they get any bigger? Well, there's talks of expanding our location. But can they get any bigger? Like, I mean, I feel like... How many wing stops are there in the <clears> state <throat> of Colorado? That's not what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? I'm saying, like, can we get any bigger? Like, we're already, like, super busy on Fridays, super busy on Sundays. I think we're, like... I'm saying, like, open more stores. Oh, okay. Henceforth, well, why he has to make more sauce. I mean, yeah. But we're the biggest location. We use the most sauce. Yes. And he's gonna. I just. I'm. I'm. I'm gonna go. You're always right, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with your gut. Why would you call that? Wasn't even saying that. He's, he he's would. Gonna, I was asking. He's gonna. He's gonna go. Uh, he's gonna ship down all those containers of sauces. Oh my gosh! I'm not even saying shipping. I'm just saying in the state of Colorado, uh-huh. if they were to open like ten, ten additional, so a total of like fifteen. Like one right down, like like Starbucks. More spread out, like Grand Junction, like arvada like fort collins two miles down the street sure a mile and a half down the yes. street, right next door do you think he would have to spend all his time making sauces and he wouldn't have time to be in the mm-hmm. kitchen because he already t- does monday and tuesday doing no. sauces and that's only for five stores you know what i think i think he needs some trustworthy guys <laughs> that know the ins and outs of golden flame in Aurora, specifically. Yeah. That he's going to give us the sauces. And he's going to be like, run free. Go find your location. It's going to be like, it's going to be like a treasure hunt. It's going to be like, it's a, like a sheet of paper. It's a deed of land. Oh, interesting. And he's going to give it to us. And at the top, it's going to be like, if you find this, I'm going to give you the sauce recipes. Mm-hmm. but only for a certain amount of sauces. Mm-hmm. And if you give the other sauces to the other contestants, I'll behead you and your dog. <laughs> and a dog. Wow. That got dark real quick. It's been the second time that I've used that analogy. I know. <laughs> <laughs> you got some pent-up stuff about a dog, apparently. No, just the human. Oh, okay. You know what? Who's to say we even have to do a full hour? You just want to stop filming this episode really bad. Listen, we have nothing to talk about. We're grasping at stuff here. Okay. Closing statements? You don't want to stop? I said closing statements? But in an upset manner. Closing statements? So now you're upset with me. and That's not what I want. It's not the point of this podcast. The point of this podcast is to bring us together. See, he is upset with me now. Sir, we can't give long period breaks because the audio listeners will be listening in their car or at work and they think that their phone paused or disconnected or something. What would you like to talk about? Let's see. What's what's new? What's happening in the news lately? Not a whole lot. You know what? This is what we're gonna this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna head to our phone here. 
Get head over to X. All right. Get a, get a head over to X here. How do you view the trending again? Oh yeah, right here. We're gonna go to trending, and we're gonna scroll through this. Okay. We have WWE Raw. Got to pass on that one. Don't know anything about that. We have Jets. The Aaron Rodgers thing where he's possibly going to be coming back. No way. I didn't see that. I saw him about like throwing, throwing uh, the football. I saw that. Yeah. After two months. Two months after his his Achilles surgery. They have Cam Thomas in the NBA. We have Cam Reddish from the NBA. We have the Chargers. We have Lazard. We have the family Chantel. We have Pritchard. We have the Heat Culture. We have Zoe. We have Hackett. Angel Reese. Grant Nelson. Can't, <laughs> what is this? This is not helpful whatsoever. <clears throat> How about that old new Fortnite map? It's crazy. Heard a lot of cool stuff about it. Are you going to play it? Probably not. Oh, okay. When do you think you'll play video games again? When I'm about to end it all, so be careful. You're making awfully a lot of those types of jokes lately. Yeah. It's growing up. It does a lot to you. That's no good. Yeah, it sucks, man. Don't grow up. What's going on? A lot. In my brain. <laughs> At all times. Like what? Loud noises <laughs> that I can't shut up most of the time. Is it like yelling? Yeah. Loud beeps. Like a toy truck. Like backing up? Yeah. At all times. Interesting. That's no S good. The static sound. One of the big TVs. At all times. But you know what calms me down? What's that? You and basketball. Good. So right now, it's all going away. I'm glad I could be that for you. Of course. Always. I feel like we don't talk about your well-being enough. Who cares? <laughs> I do. What do you mean? Makes one of us. <laughs> Ball is life. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Can't wait to go play basketball tomorrow. I'll wait. I can't. What do you mean? Trails isn't open tomorrow. So I might go On to Central. Tuesday? Yeah. Why? Every Tuesday. They're not open at 1230. They're only open at the nighttime. Like the whole gym or just the court? Just the court. That work. Yeah. That's weird. That is weird. Have you ever thought about reserving the pickleball court and just working on your dribbling? No. Why not? Because I want to shoot. That's fair. I guess you have other gyms to go to, so it's not a problem. Mm -hmm. well, I can just play outside, too. Also true. The way this weather's been. Like, it's November, and it's only snowed once this this season. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a rather hot summer, though. Yeah. It's it makes me just, worried. It's going to be a really fucking cold winter. Yeah. My car already stopped once. Your car? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. It's okay. Like the battery? Yeah. You had to use your jumper thing? Mm-hmm. Oh, no. When was that? I think last week. When it got cold? Mm -hmm. It's supposed to get really cold on Wednesday again. Yeah. So make sure that bad boy's charged up. Always mm -hmm. is. Good. What now, would you at? like to do any closing statements? <laughs> <laughs> sure. What would you like to say to the fine people at home? 
even though this podcast had no drive, no story, no nothing to it, I still think it was one of our better ones. And that's a special shout out to him and you. So if you're still here, which let's be honest, no one's here. We love you. We're not I even love here. you. We're not. <laughs> that's one of the truest things he said all evening. We love you terribly. Go check out our merch. Buy it. I love you. Or we don't. love you. Or don't. Yeah. Live your life. Shout make, out. Make, make hate merch for us. We'll even like you even more. Shout out has to go to um, our woman, Edis. Just because she said she's our biggest hater. So. Makes sense. Shout out Edis for hating us. We appreciate you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I'm okay. going to say uh, my closing statement is going to be uh, whatever you do, you know what? It's you. It's you. It's unique. Special. You got to keep doing it. You're amazing. You're amazing at what you do. You're amazing at what you strive to be. I'm not looking at you right now. I'm looking at you in the future. And guess what? That person 17 times is better than the person that I'm looking at right now. Wow. So go fuck yourself and get better. That's for you. Not you. Fuck it. Get out of it. <laughs> you. Yes, you. Get out there. Be your best self. My shout out of the week is you. I like that. So make sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, hit the bell, and uh, 